Hello guys, welcome to Top Celebrities. Today we bring you the latest drama and controversy trending about Taylor Swift's dad, Travis Kulse and a victimized injured photographer. What really happened? I will give you all the exclusive details about the drama, watch and be informed. Before we do begin, I will be grateful if you take out time to check our previous videos with exclusive updates and discussions about Justin Bieber, Selena Gomez and Hailey Bieber. You will love the updates trust me. Now let's immediately dive into the details. A photographer told police he was punched in the face by Taylor Swift's father on the Sydney waterfront on Tuesday, hours after the pop star's Australian tour ended. The photographer by name, Ben McDonald, said he provided police with a statement alleging that Scott Swift assaulted him at the neutral Bay Wharf, where the father and daughter had just come ashore from a yacht. The veteran paparazzo said he decided to report the attack to police, despite not being seriously injured. It was just a punch in the chops. It's a little tender, but I don't have any bruising, and it didn't require medical assistance McDonald said. In 23 years, I haven't been assaulted and punched in the chops particularly by the talent's dad he added. So he decided to report because it is not his first encounter with Swift's dad. Do you think this was fair to the photographer? Did he deserve a punch for doing his job? Taylor Swift's representative accused members of the media of aggression during the interaction. Two individuals were aggressively pushing their way towards Taylor, grabbing at her security personnel, and threatening to throw a female staff member into the water, the representative said in an email. The new cell South Wales Police Force Media Office confirmed that police were investigating the alleged assault of a 51-year-old man by a 71-year-old man at 2.30 a.m., but police did not release names. In accordance with their policy for such allegations, Taylor Swift left the country on a private jet Tuesday, after more than 600,000 fans saw the Australian leg of her era's tour at seven Australian stadium concerts. McDonald said media had been waiting to photograph the star as she walked with her entourage from a jetty to two waiting cars. There were about four or five security there, and at one point, one of the American security started shoving his umbrella into me and my camera, and then Taylor got in her car McDonald told the Associated Press. Someone else came running at me and punched me in the left side of my face. Initially, I thought it was an Australian security that was trying to be the hero of the moment in the front of the Americans, but as it turned out it was her father McDonald added. McDonald said he realized that his alleged assailant was not a part of the security detail, after seeing a photo of him holding Swift's hand, while reviewing photos from the evening. McDonald later identified Scott Swift from an online picture. McDonald said there had been no cause for violence. We didn't go rushing down the jetty. We didn't go rushing to the back of the boat. We waited for her to come up. Kept it very civil he said. But no, they had to be expletives and put the umbrellas up and umbrellas over her, and then shove the umbrellas into our faces, and then make out that we're the ones making contact with them he added. What do you make of this update? Let us know your thoughts in the comments and kindly like and share our videos to support us. Do well to watch and enjoy our previous videos. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel, like and share our videos to support us.